Alright, so here's the menu, and uh, if I move the cursor over an icon, it'll say what it is. So, um, here's the gallery. Go to the gallery. Where you save all your pictures, I mean where all your saved pictures go. And as you can see, the icon here is uh, American Gothic, but with pigs. <laughs> Paint a new picture. This is where you go when you want to make a new picture. And then these are the coloring books. Show the amusement park coloring book. Show the animals coloring book. Show the Earth Matters coloring book. Show the fun and games coloring book. Show the space explorers coloring book. Show the seasons coloring book. Show the trains, planes, and automobiles coloring book. Show the fun with fruit and veggies coloring book. And then this. Let's watch the show. We'll get to that later. Alright, so this is where you want to go when you want to make a new picture. And these are little jars. Like the printer picture. These are, um, these down here are jars of paint. And you do, and what you do is you use these to fill, to fill with color. Fill with color. Yeah. And you can do rainbow. <laughs> You can do uh, vertical, rainbow. I draw with markers. Um, or uh, I'll just go back so I can start over. If you want to do a solid color, whoops, my bad. You do this to choose a solid color, Yellow. green, like that. Or well, you can do different combinations as well, like that or that. Rainbow. But yeah, uh, these are all the different colors, and just like before, if you move the cursor uh, over it, uh, it'll say what it is. But then again, it does that throughout the whole game. This band aid right here is if you want to undo your mistakes. Undo a boo boo. Want to show you something? If you've just started and you haven't done anything before, It'll just keep saying it. Undo a boo boo, undo a boo boo, undo 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 don't know what it is. Looks like Undo. confetti, almost. Clouds. More, more patterns. This one's a Undo cool a boo -boo. one. Ah, oh, shut up. Uh, this is a cool one. It's like steel. And let me show you the other things that you can do. Um, oops. Blue hand. Oh, uh, if I keep holding it down, I'll just keep repeating the sound. Listen. <laughs> Creepy. So these are the different ways you can erase things. Normal eraser. Click to erase or explode some or all of your picture. This is... This is basically makes the makes the uh, shut up. This makes the eraser stronger, like more po more powerful. The other things that you can do, just
so those are the different ways you can erase things. And, uh... Add stickers to your picture. This is, this is the stickers part. And these are all the different stickers you can put on there. There's the bear, bird, cat, turtle, fish. I think that's a gazelle. Kangaroo, lion, sipping on a soda. Add stickers to your picture. I think it's a soda. Who cares? Frilled, li frilled lizard. Mole with sunglasses. Monkey. Moose. Dog. Sorry, dog. Uh, snake. Tiger. And a pig. Now, let's say I want to choose a turtle. And I want to color it. Oops. Erase or explode a picture. Just playing around with it, showing you the different things you can do. So there, we've, uh, we've recolored the turtle. Now it looks kind of like a tortoise, in a way. Now let me uh, erase this. Show you how to draw with crayons. Draw with crayons. Well, I'm pretty sure you, you know how to do crayons already in real life, but um, and again, who doesn't? Unless, unless you have never used crayons before, but whatever. Uh, anyway, uh, show you the different things you can do. I'll make the size bigger so you can um, um, see Red. see in more detail. So, so that's what that looks like with, boo -boo. with the normal crayon. This one's just kind of looks like sparkles. And then that one's a swirly motion. <laughs> I mean, uh, it's just uh, a swirl. And this one is a has a circle of six dots. Just wanted to do that. And this one's in uh, a chain. And this one is a little softer. This one's a row of spots. And then this one is like a smear. This one is a zigzag. And this one is a loop. And then I'm going to show you something else. With Click to turn the mirror effect on and off. This is the mirror effect, so you can do, if you do a line, it'll reverse it on the other side. So it'll be like a Rorschach, almost. See? Cool, huh? But yeah, it just keeps, just keeps doing it. So what do you see here? <laughs> uh, I don't see anything. Draw with markers. Now here's the markers. 
Alright, so you can do different, um, you can go vertically or horizontally. Click to tell the marker whether to mix colors or not. So you can overlap. No, wait, never mind. You can take two colors and overlap them, or you can choose not to overlap them. And then with this, just makes a square shaped um, uh, point. And then this one is just three dots or lines. So this is kind of like what they did with the um, with the uh, with the crayons. Next is the crazy lines. Draw crazy lines. So you can do different things with. So you can do different things with the crazy lines. You can do. Oops. You can do an ice cream cone. Uh, a car. Caterpillar. A wiener dog. Cactus. Arrow. Sorry, arrow. Snake. Lizard. Paddle ball. And a bowling. A boo -boo. Bowling ball and pins. Draw shapes. This is the shapes part. So you can do different kinds of shapes. Anyway, uh, uh, sorry, wrong one. There's different things you can do with shapes. Uh, like to turn the shape filler on and off. With the shape uh, yeah, filler, rainbow. with the shape filler, you can um, you can um, sorry, I'm at loss for words. Um, basically, you can have the option if if when you create a shape. It can, it can be blank or it can be filled. If the filler effect's on, then it just fills it automatically. Choose 2D or 3D shapes. This is cool. You can do shapes that are in three dimensions. A box. Type words and numbers. And here's the type words and numbers thing. At the bottom are different fonts. You can choose the different size of the fonts. You can have it sideways, either facing up, down, have the have the left side facing down or the right side facing down. Different, choose different fonts, and I chose Times New Roman. F R A G I L E. Where is it? Oh, dang it! Let me try to do that again. Okay, so there's our box. Now, last part I want to show you is watercolors. Paint with watercolors. 
Alright, so this is basically says it all. It's just painting with watercolors and pick the amount of water to add to the paint. If you can add have more or less. And just like with the crayon and the marker, you can choose different styles. And uh, use the picture tool. Picture tool allows you to do different things with your picture um, later on. You can save it. Click to save your picture in the gallery. Click to print your picture. To print your print your picture. <laughs> um, to print your picture out. Or click to save your picture to a floppy diskette. Click to load your picture from a floppy diskette. And then uh, that's it. And then I'll show the 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 show in another video. So anyway, that's Crayola Art, and uh, hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. With the program, it's been fun playing with you today.